So I'm Andrew Dobson, uh, I'm 49 year old. Um, at my first attempt at gastric sleeve, I was 149 and a half kilos. That was in January 24. Today I'm currently 136 kilos. Um, the day of my gastric sleeve surgery. So Andrew's case is quite peculiar. Um, Andrew has had an attempted prior bariatric operation that was in the UK with another bariatric surgeon in the private sector. Uh, they managed to do half of the operation but then they had to abandon because of difficulties during the procedure. We do understand that they encountered some problems at the top of the stomach but I think that's going to be the challenge of trying to deliver this operation safely for this patient. However, the team at our hospital is quite capable of handling the situation. We of course have other instruments such as long telescopes in case we have difficulty accessing this top part of the stomach where the previous surgeon had the problem. Well, oh, I was devastated, totally devastated. You, you've built yourself up, it's pretty, it's pretty daunting experience anyway. Basically, you don't know where you're at, you don't know where it leaves you, you don't know what your next step is. Um, it's a minefield. So if I was to give somebody some advice entering into this journey, do your research, look around, definitely look further afield. You basically think that all surgery is going to be the same, all um, surgeons are going to be the same in the UK. It's not the case, you, you've got to do your research. So the reason I chose Selfie Awake was uh, after doing all the research and having, having the issues on hand, they have more support than I've found elsewhere. A higher level of expertise, which they bring across to you confidently, which gives you confidence moving forward. When I first spoke to Rishi, he gave me the confidence that he had no qualms about doing the surgery and was very confident in his own abilities to get it done this time. So, fingers crossed. <laughs> so, obviously in the future, I'm looking forward to a more, more healthy and active lifestyle. Uh, I've got twin boys, so being able to keep up with them a little bit more than I do now. They're getting quicker, I'm getting slower, which uh, isn't ideal, but uh, hopefully this is a way of um, redressing the balance. Well, naturally, uh, with the failed surgery before, I'm very nervous, very apprehensive. However, everybody's been so accommodating and so friendly, so that kind of puts you at ease. Rishi has been in and introduced himself again. He's very confident in his own ability, which gives me confidence in his ability. The only thing to do is get him a fancy dress gown and uh, the charm and uh, Nora Batty socks, and then uh, off we go. <laughs>then half of the operation now the stomach was a bit stuck because of the previous operation but you've taken all those adhesions down the spleen was intact it wasn't injured maybe there was a bit of bleeding in the past um, the liver looks normal it's a bit small actually so apart from slight difficulties during mobilization I don't think we've had any problems we'll start stapling now so we should be done in around 20 minutes